this morning. You know what's even more overwhelming than preparing for a Thanksgiving meal? Your entire family getting sick after eating it. Yeah, that would do it. Yeah, the salmonella risk is real this year and it's linked to the main thing on your plate, turkey. In fact, the CDC calls it an outbreak. Minnesota has 17 cases and it's important to note that no single turkey supplier has been identified as the source of this outbreak. So we want to help you make sure the food you serve is safe. So we fed Kai Edwards a bunch of turkey this weekend. <laughs> how are you feeling how it goes. this morning? You guys know I don't even eat turkey. <laughs> I love that I'm on this segment. Okay, so yeah, there's a lot to consider, right? Right? Yes. When you're going to be preparing for Thanksgiving, yes. you know, which turkey do you select? How long can you keep the leftovers? But this is Jess Larson, yes. food blogger. She's going to help answer all of your questions. And we're going to start talking about kitchen prep. Yes. It starts with that. Yes. Actually, it starts with the turkey. If you're using a frozen turkey, you need to be thinking about prepping it a few days in advance. Okay. Um, it takes, you'll want to thaw out your turkey in the refrigerator. It's, that's the safest way to do it to avoid that salmonella. Um, and it takes about 24 hours per five pounds of turkey. Okay. So if you are prepping a 15 pound turkey on Thursday, today is the day to take that turkey out um, and thaw it out in the fridge. Okay, so today, Monday, get Monday. it done. And yes. then what about the kitchen and keeping everything separated? What do you do? Yes, so it's really Really important that on Thursday morning you're starting with clean surfaces in your entire kitchen. Um, clean knives, clean cutting boards, etc. You don't want to contaminate the turkey before you even start cooking it. Sure. So start clean and then as you're cooking it, as you're touching the turkey, handling the turkey, everything that comes into contact with the turkey, your knives, your cutting boards, your hands, needs to be washed in hot soapy water for 20 seconds before um, it can handle anything else. So that will really help avoid any cross-contamination with the turkey and the rest of your Thanksgiving meal. That makes sense. I think you do that for other meats too anyway. Yes. Like, yep. You should. Yes. You should. Okay. Yeah, same applies. Um, so that's awesome. Any other uh, preps that we need to know? No, nope. get that turkey thawed out for sure and um, start cleaning your kitchen for okay. Thursday. Yeah, absolutely. All right, so now we're going to talk with you in the next half hour again about yes. some of the myths that are out there. Some of the things you might have mm -hmm. heard could save you time, but turns out mm -mm. not so much. Yeah. <laughs> All right, we'll see you then. Yes.